The growth of small and medium enterprises is an important engine for poverty reduction in developing economies like Uganda, leave alone contributing to the national revenue. However, lack of access to capital is a critical limitation. Having realized the importance, Grofin, a South African-based financier that helps entrepreneurs and business owners to access tailored finance in nine African countries, including Uganda, has made an initial commitment of 100 million US dollar fund that will be accessed by over 60 Ugandan small and medium enterprises. The successful SMEs will also be helped to access enterprise information, market linkages and guidance on identification and managing of risks. Because you have such a strength of entrepreneurs here. People are so entrepreneurial, but they have difficulty accessing finance. And uh, what the Grofin model does is help them overcome those, those problems by investing on the basis of viability, investing on the basis of their entrepreneurial capability, and then supporting these businesses to become sustainable. The SMEs that will benefit from this fund are expected to have clear book records that show their development and clear banking records. Those with workable business ideas will also benefit. It is available to any entrepreneur that meets the finance criteria and who we believe in has got a sustainable business idea and has got the ability to run a sustainable business in accordance with, with international standards and criteria. The East African Community Minister, Shem Bagene, acknowledged the high interest rates on commercial bank loans, saying the fund such as this will offer alternative access to finance. High, and it is very difficult to envisage somebody doing a business and getting a return of 30% gross. Now, if you are going to borrow money at 30%, you won't make both ends meet. In other words, then the business you're trying to do collapses financially. So Grofin has come in, one, not asking for these provisions of titles, charity, and so on, but also at interest rates which are manageable, lower than what the commercial banks are offering in this country. So what we urge our business community to do right now is to make sure that they keep their house, uh, they uh, put their houses in the order so that they have their records properly and they can account for their expenses, they can uh, have records of their profits and uh, once you are getting them funds, somebody will know that your company or your business is profitable and both sustainable. The Grofin Small and Growing Business Fund is expected to grow to 1.5 million US dollars in the next two years. Sampona Haima, NBS, Sunset.